Well, the Santa Fe School Board met tonight and passed a resolution allowing students to, to participate in a nationwide 17 minute walkout to show support for the 17 students and faculty who were killed in the Florida shooting two weeks ago. Students say they'd walk out regardless of what the board decided. I'm here because it's my school, my life, my friends' lives. Chloe Hanna is a senior at New Mexico School for the Arts and says the recent school shootings have changed her feelings about going to school each day. I go to school and I hope that I don't wake up with another Snapchat that says, hey, just want you to know that there was another shooting threat. Students say they're tired of it. Santa Fe High School's most recent threat was this past Friday. Theo Goujon asked the school board to consider new drill protocols. So if the fire alarm is pulled, for example, faculty confirms there's actually a fire before all of the students leave their classrooms. He says he's scared for his little sister starting high school next year. I have a younger sister and she means the world to me. She, I, I love her a lot and she's an eighth grader. She's going to be going to Santa Fe High next year as a freshman and it terrifies me. Students are planning a walkout next month to show their support for the high school shooting victims in Florida. This in the midst of a nationwide gun debate. One thing on the table, arming teachers. I spoke with the owner of ABQ Guns who supports teachers having guns, but only those who want to and says they'd have to go through extensive training before having a gun in class. If you allow it, okay, then the ones that do will. But it's a huge responsibility. And as the debate continues, students say their voices will be heard during the walkout on March 14th. A Santa Fe High School student tells me he's planning a protest at the Roundhouse in April. Justin Matthews, KYT Action 7 News. Governor